If Airshow is not working and you need an alternative, could this be the solution? Hey folks, welcome back to the journal for a very quick update on Airshow, the iOS screen recorder, which is still currently not working as I'm going to demonstrate here. However, in the YouTube comments, I did get a potential alternative from a person called Simpy who recommended an app called BB Record, which is actually available on the App Store. So no need to download it off the App Store, jailbreak or device or anything. And this is it. It's actually called BB Rec, so make sure you type in that when you are searching for it on the App Store and you can download it like any usual app. So it sounds like brilliant news, right? Well, not quite. But before I go into detail, I recommend downloading this app from the App Store immediately because they often get taken down very quickly because they are screen recorders. Okay, on to BB Record itself. Like Airshow, BB Record does have some options in terms of changing the video quality and definition. I haven't messed around too much with these because I just wanted to do a very quick test. Now the problems tend to start when you actually try and record something. I'm going to do record now. You set your orientation when you start to record, but when it's spooling up and you don't have to go to the airplay options and start mirroring it like you do in Airshow, but if you see the record time, it gets stuck at 0, 01. And if it does, that basically means your screen recording is going to fail. And if I stop it, it will give you a message saying it's failed. So an unreliable screen recorder is not a very good one. Through testing, the only reliable way to get a screen recording which is likely to work is to go into the recorder and start a recording and wait for the timer to go above 10 seconds. That should mean that the screen recording will start and finish and save when you want to. You might have also noticed that I closed down the application when I started the recording and this time the timer is going to go above 10 seconds and so I can be confident at least to, su to some extent that this is going to complete the recording and off we go. So I'm just going to speed the video up while I do the recording on the screen. I haven't done a very long recording yet but this one was 40 seconds to do a quick test and when you stop recording it will say that it has successfully recorded and if I go to my videos we can see it at the top which oddly enough seems to be in portrait even though I told it to be in landscape so that might be another concern when you're doing recordings. As for the quality and the sound, well, it does seem to record that fine. But as with Airshow, it does record from the microphone, so it's picking up a lot of background noise. Now onto the final problem. The videos are saved within BB Rec, and I can't work out how to get them out of the program. If I swipe to the left, I get these options to edit, share, and delete. I try the share button, and it just crashes out of the program. So I can't get access to the videos to do anything with them, which is disappointing. So personally, I wouldn't recommend this BB Rec application, but on speaking to Simpy, his version seems to be working fine. So maybe it's just my iPad, which is having a few arguments with the application. So you might as well try it, give it a go. See if it's any better than Airshow. Do let me know in the comments. I'd really love to know if BB Rec is a potential alternative. So we've got something else to work with on iOS devices. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Enjoy the rest of your tech day. And I will of course keep you updated on Airshow when that's back up and running as well.